what's here my home chef order I'm so excited because I forgot it was coming today and I just got home from we were out at like Target and Marshalls all day and on the way home I almost stopped and got fast food because I was like what the heck am I gonna make for dinner I'm making my food now, if you guys don't know what Home Chef is, I love Home Chef. I, this is not my first time using them. I absolutely love them and they always taste so good. But anyways, what it is, is it is a home meal kit delivery service. So what you do is you go on their website and you get to choose from 17 weekly menu options. There's tons to choose from. And they have ones for if you're vegetarian, if you're trying to be more calorie conscious, if you don't want nuts or you don't want milk. They have all those different options for you and then you choose how many servings you want and the day of the week that you want your meal kit to arrive. And then that's it. The whole meal kit with all your food comes directly to your door. And then get this, everything is pre-portioned out. So you don't have to measure anything. You don't have to do like any work. You don't have to figure out if something's two tablespoons or a cup or anything. It comes in the exact portion sizes that you need with the instructions, which might I add are picture instructions. So it makes it so simple because I like looking at pictures so I can see like if it looks like how it should at that process or at that step, if that makes sense. So it's so simple. I love it ever since becoming a mom because I had this idea in my head that like, oh, when I become a stay-at-home mom, I'm gonna make a fresh home-cooked meal every night and yada yada. And you know what? Sometimes it's just not realistic. So this makes it so much easier for me because I have fresh ingredients coming to my door with simple, easy instructions so that I can make healthy, easy meals for my family. So if you guys want to try out Home Chef, I'm gonna have their link in the description. Make sure you use code LaurenM30 and you'll get $30 off your first order, which is awesome because then you get to try some meals and you're not like super committed or anything like that. You can just try it out. Now this video is sponsored by Home Chef, but I absolutely love their company. This is like my totally honest opinion. These meals are always so, so good. And I did wanna let you guys know, I don't receive anything from you signing up with the company. Like it's not an affiliate link. If you use my code, I don't get any kind of pay or anything like that. So it's strictly benefiting you guys. So if you wanna use code LaurenM30, you'll get $30 off your first order. I highly recommend them. But yeah, let's just get into the cooking. I'm really excited. <laughs> Lost again, going back around Dreaming of a time when I get things right Lost in the shadows of a million stars Shouldn't they mind my near and far? So this is something kind of silly that I always do and tell me if you do the same but if I'm waiting for um, any kind of food to cook or sometimes if I'm just watching a show I'll try to do like some squats or lunges Just something to get a little bit of exercise in because I'm gonna be honest. I'm lacking in the exercising department lately The vegetables are still cooking. So I gave him some chicken It's really good that like ranch olive oil dressing. I put on top of it was so yummy. You like it bud? Uh. You like it? Is it yummy? Baby approved. Okay, look at this massive salad. I don't think I'm gonna be able to eat all this. Obviously this is meant for two servings. I'm gonna share it with Will. I gave him like half of my chicken already. Oh my gosh, all I've tried so far is the chicken and let me say it was insane how good it was. Okay, it's a commercial. <laughs> let me pause this. So my favorite show ever, the challenge is on and I finished cooking like just in time. Um, I had timed it perfectly and I put Will to bed. So guys, this salad is so big. I just ended up putting it back in this big bowl that I like tossed it in. This is next level good. Like I'm not even a salad person. I'm just trying, was trying to be healthier and because one of the items I picked up for this week was a pizza, I was like, well, let me do a salad, like a spinach salad and be a little bit healthier. This is insane. Insane how good it is. Also, it's like spinach, vegetables and chicken. The only thing even remotely bad in this would be the dressing, but there was like maybe like a couple 
tablespoons of mayonnaise and sour cream and that was like it it's so good okay I'm gonna stop saying it's good but I just like don't know how to vocalize to you guys how good this salad is I'm this isn't this is probably my favorite thing I've gotten from home chef so far and it's a salad which is crazy is anyone else still like obsessed with the whole Teen Mom franchise? I love Teen Mom. I love Teen Mom 2, Teen Mom OG, this Young and Pregnant show. I love it all. <laughs> oh, my show's back. Okay, I don't know how I did it, but I'm almost done. I'm so ridiculously full, but it's so good. I should just like go put the plate up so I don't eat anymore. I'm so full. At least it's healthy food, but oh my gosh, I'm so full, but it's so good. I probably will finish it. But I love this show. Just sing. I'm finally updating my computer. I don't know if anyone else does this, but it's been saying it needs a software update for like two months now, and I always say remind me later, so I finally just let it do its thing. <sighs> I guess I should go like take a shower or something while this is doing it since I can't edit anyways. Okay, I think I'm going to shower and then go to bed and I will continue vlogging in the morning. Bye guys! Say good morning. William. Psst, 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 psst. William, say good morning. So let me show you guys. I have a few things I'm excited about. Okay. So I bought these shelves the other day from Hobby Lobby and I really like them, however, I don't think they're wide enough for the space. I don't, like, I think that I'm going to end up returning these, or maybe I'll use these in the dining room and just go with my original plan of building my own shelves, like just getting wood from Home Depot, because I want them to be, like, that long, maybe. And then I am buying a dresser that I found off of Facebook Marketplace. Me and James are going to go pick it up tomorrow, and I'm really excited, and it's going to fill pretty much this whole area that's why i wanted to get a dresser instead of a side table because if i back up whoop, i feel like it would look really nice if this whole area was pretty much filled and then there could be a lamp right there and some decor plus like two longer shelves above it what do you guys think tell me in the description i think it's going to be super cute sorry i keep kicking stuff on the ground here's some stuff i'm going to have a haul coming soon just some things i picked up for these shelves and i really like how it looked don't get me wrong i just think they're way too small for this wall and plus so on top of that excuse the living room look at that little face uh, huh so you guys know that i have been talking about for a while that i didn't know what to do with this wall and i got a few recommendations that i should get like a hutch so i found a smallish hutch it'll probably be like this big it's not like a ginormous one because those are really expensive but I found it on Facebook marketplace and I have been searching on there for a while but all of them are like a hundred to two hundred dollars and then every once in a while there will be one for like mm, 75 80 dollars but then it's like snatched up by the time I can message the person so let me show you okay sorry my camera died so I had to recharge it so this is the hutch I found on Facebook Marketplace, and it's only $40, and I just feel like that's such a good deal. It's not like a huge hutch. You can kind of tell it only has like the two doors where some of them have four, but for only $40, I just felt like that was such a good idea. I've been like scoping out Facebook for a while now, and a lot of them, especially if they're already painted, run like $200, $300. I mean, some people put them on there for like $700, which I feel like it's never going to sell. So I'm thinking of putting it there with maybe a shelf on each side and styling it really cute or something. I've also thought about maybe putting it there instead, but we'll see. So I just put William down for a nap. 
Something else I wanted to show you guys, I just closed the curtains because I wanted to give you the full effect. So a lot of you know that I had those blue and white curtains in here. Oh, they're right there. I took them down and I put these up. They were pretty cheap. They were like $14.99 for both panels at like Home Goods, And I don't know, I like it so much better. The blue and white, white was nice, I think for like spring or summer, it's beautiful. It didn't really go with the fall decor and um, I just felt like it was hard to style this room because of those curtains. Now I actually feel like the room looks a lot bigger because um, it doesn't stop, like it doesn't make you think that the walls stop so soon, if that even makes sense. And now I've just been on the hunt for like a table runner, but this table is actually like 75 inches long and every table runner that I see at like Target, Home Goods, TJ Maxx is 72 inches. And so I need to find one that's a 90 inch. So try to find one. Also, I guess I'll just show you this. I got this, I thought it was really cute. I got this at Hobby Lobby. I'm gonna do a haul, but I got this on sale and it was only $8, so I thought that was a really good deal. It's about 11.18, so I'm going to get started on this wood-fired barbecue chicken pizza. It looks so good. It says it's going to take 35 to 45 minutes to take, but that it's easy. And so this is what James, William, and I are going to have for lunch. Coming up like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door Onions are like my favorite part of every meal. I love onions. Honestly, if this didn't have onions on it, I would probably add them. I just seriously love onions, and thankfully my husband does too, and William does too so far. So. Oh my gosh, look how good they look. I think they need a couple more minutes just because I like my pizzas crispy, but oh my goodness, they smell good too. Look how good that looks, James. Does that not look yummy? I think that's the closest I've ever gotten to the picture. Oh my god. Looks so good. Wow. Look at this. Okay, James is going to try his. Mm. <laughs> what do you think? It's very good. Is it? Mm -hmm. It looks amazing. We have more. I have another because I got two of those, so I'll, I can make another one tomorrow or the next day for lunch. You like? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to be having my first bite now that I still didn't get William to sleep, but he's in there putting himself to sleep. <laughs> oh my gosh, I was not the like bread is really good too. Mmm. Cause I've never had a pizza on this thing, so I didn't know what it was. I thought this was gonna taste like when we used to make pizzas on the quesadilla type things. This is so good. Wow. I thought that salad was my favorite, but I think this is my favorite now. Oh my god. Wow. I don't know why, but I was also weary about the type of cheese because I always think pizza needs to have like mozzarella. But they like knew what they were doing. This is really good. Mmm, 10 out of 10. Once again, I'll have the link in my description. Highly recommend you guys. It's so good, so easy. Comes straight to your doorstep. This is so good. <laughs> mm. I'm looking out 